so today's video we're going to be testing out the Tarte Chrome Paint. So here I have three shades. I have the shade Park Avin Princess, Fire Dancer and Top Yacht. So these retail for £19 each and basically here's what it does. So this is what it says on the website. It says dazzle with spectacular mirrored metallic effect that has the high sheen of a cream or a gloss but the easy way of application of a powder with over 80% pure pearl pigment it's easy to use a finger paint no brush needed it says oh you try layering on your favorite powder eyeshadows on top of this long wear formula it'll make your look pop and last all night so I'm not going to do it on top of my favorite eyeshadow I'm just going to do it on primed eyelids so obviously I've already got like crease colours and stuff down so I'm going to take today I'm going to take fire dancer so basically when you open them up these are what they look like and you open them up and they literally look like well pots of shadow so I'm just going to dip my finger in it says no need for brush but Obviously, where I've got quite hooded lids, it's a bit difficult to get, like, in certain places. So, I am going to try this side with a finger and then this side with a brush. So, let's just de into this. This feels, like, really soft. It looks absolutely beautiful as well. Oh, my God. That's so freaking beautiful, like, I can't get over how stunning that is. I'm just going to try and blend out the sort of corner, so there's no extra product on this brush, I just want to sort of blend it in. That looks so pretty. I wish I could get right into the corner with my finger just to sort of finish it off. But I'm going to take a brush on this side. So this is the Spectrum A16 brush, which looks like just a flat brush. Definitely feel like you get a bit more pigment with your finger rather than the brush. But I feel like, actually I'm just going to sort of, but, so I think you need a brush just to get into like the inner parts of your eyes and a little sort of like little bits that you can't get with your finger, but definitely I think the finger works better. That was super easy to put on and it blends really nice as well, like into sort of my other colour that we put down. So I am going to take one for the inner corner and brow bone. So I'm going to take Top Yacht and unfortunately it did arrive broken to me. So I just put a little bit of um, alcohol spray on it and just sort of mushed it back together, which isn't ideal, but hey ho. So I am going to take a little brush. This is a Real Techniques Ascent brush. That's really pretty in the inner corner. I think this would look so nice all over the lid as well. So I can't remember if I said or not, but there are six shades in the collection so far, but hopefully I do add more because it's so beautiful. And Tarte do now ship to the UK, like there's no tax or custom charges or anything. So I think if you, I'm pretty sure if you spend over £30 you get free shipping. So yeah, that's a bonus now. Especially for people that wanted like shape tape and stuff. So basically I'm just going to pop on some lashes and mascara and then I'll be back. Okay, so lashes are on. Everything that I'm wearing will be listed down below. The eyeshadow, these lashes are quite big by the way, so I've got to like, pull them down still looks really amazing and really metallic 
Um, I'm going to wear this throughout the day. So the checking time is quarter to three. It's a bit of a late checking time, but I'll wear this throughout the day and see how it wears. So the checking time is half past 10 or 35 past 10. I do not have my phone, so that's why we're looking at my watch. So the eyeshadow has been on since three, seven hours, I think. And it still looks beautiful. Even like the inner corner highlights still stayed. Just absolutely stunning. I absolutely love them. Hope they bring out more colors. Really, really beautiful. Um, I think that's about it. I did try a new eyelash glue and that's why I have no eyelashes on. Cause I literally went boop and it just fell off. So not really feeling the eyelash glue, but yeah, the eyeshadow looks bomb. So that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Oh my god, that was disgusting.